Our top story, her disappearance has haunted a Missouri town for nearly 35 years. You know, this is a town where you would not lock your doors. Tonight, investigators confirming a new search for Gina Dawn Brooks. We're told evidence was collected during a massive search of a property in Bollinger County. Good evening, I'm Mike Bush. And I'm Kelly Jackson. This week's search took place about 15 miles away from where the 13-year-old girl was last seen in Fredericktown. Laura Barcheski just got back from that community with reaction, Laura. Mike and Kelly, the people of Fredericktown say the disappearance of Gina Dawn Brooks changed the entire town forever, and these recent developments have given them hope that they might find closure soon. Yeah, the town needs it. You know, as you got a small, small town that everybody still waves at everybody. They say hi to you in Walmart and they move around you in Walmart. You know, they'll give you room and it's a small town and it people need the closure. We really do. 13-year-old Brooks disappeared in August 1989. She was out riding her bike at night, about 15 miles from the site. Law enforcement have been searching around this week in Bollinger County. The property's owner for the last 15 years spoke with Five on Your Side this week, saying an FBI agent called him three weeks ago and told him they would be looking for remains because someone in prison might have admitted information about the site. While the Missouri State Highway Patrol says they did not find any remains, they did find some items they believe could be evidence. One woman says she was about 20 years old at the time Brooks disappeared and never forgot about her. This is just an easy going town. You know, everybody was out and about. It was summer, you know, and you started looking over your shoulder or looking at your surroundings when you would go places. Three men were implicated in her disappearance, but no one was ever convicted because of the lack of evidence. The items found during the multi-day search through a dense wooded area are being sent to the Missouri State Highway Patrol Crime Laboratory for analysis. And they are still looking for answers, and anyone who knows anything is asked to call the Missouri State Highway Patrol at 573-840-9500 or at the FBI tip line at 1-800-CALL-FBI.